There was a terrifying scene in New Jersey, rather in Jersey City, that is. And it happened when a woman fell down an elevator shaft in her apartment building. CBS 2's Nick Calloway went to find out what happened. Screaming for help in agonizing pain. The cell phone video shows the frantic moments after the 53-year-old grandmother fell down the elevator shaft. I heard someone screaming very loud, you know, help me, help me, somebody help me. This man, who did not want his face shown on camera, was visiting friends at this apartment building on Gifford Avenue Monday afternoon when he heard those screams for help. As we opened the elevator door, we seen a grandmother, you know, at the bottom, you know, screaming for help. Now the elevator door is locked and covered with caution tape. Relatives say the woman had just picked her granddaughter up from the bus stop on Monday. She opened the elevator door on the first floor and walked in, not knowing the elevator wasn't there, and fell about 16 feet. Luckily, the little girl was not hurt. I tried to investigate, see if there's anything I could personally do to try to help her, but that's too, that's too deep of a fall for, you know, somebody like me. Firefighters arrived quickly and made the rescue. Relatives of the victim say she had a broken arm and a torn intestine from the fall. They say she underwent surgery on Tuesday. The building is run by Cross Country Management, based in Lakewood. Someone there sent us a statement that we are actively investigating the incident along with our elevator company. The daughter of the woman who fell down that elevator shaft said no one from the apartment management company has reached out to her or her mother. She said the family plans to file a lawsuit. In Jersey City, Nick Calloway, CBS 2 News.